Marcus Gideon and Kevin Sukamolia were number one for many years in men's doubles and was such a dynamic partnership. They went on to win multiple championships through 2017 to 2019, and Kevin being known as one of the most skillful and talented players, especially at the front of the court, and Gideon then complimenting him really well at the back, made them such an exciting pair to watch. However, in the last few years, it's been so frustrating having to watch them, and the results have dropped tremendously. The biggest problem I have with them as a pair is their attitude when they're playing. I've never seen anything like it at this level of sport. They both look like they just don't care at times, and I've seen them completely give up and stop trying. And they're blaming each other when one of them is not playing well, and their heads are always down. When they get frustrated, it's almost like you know the game's over. I just don't know how you're supposed to be at the top of your game when this happens so often, and that's just what we see in their matches. It wouldn't surprise me if they're like this in their training too. When you compare this to the Japanese uh, men's doubles players, for example, who just beat Kevin and Gideon recently, they're constantly encouraging each other and psyching themselves up. Their body language is night and day between them two. And they would never give up in a game. They want to win at all costs, unlike the Indonesian pet, where sometimes they look like they're not bothered one single bit. And it's so frustrating because everyone knows they have the ability to play good. It just shows that talent alone isn't enough to win at such a competitive men's doubles, which there is at the moment. Now, if you look at the, one of their most recent games, this is exactly what happened. They lost the first set in a close game, but you could see some frustration was setting in. And then in the second set, Gideon started to make some mistakes and lost his head altogether. Then Sukumolia was clearly frustrated and annoyed and started going for some ridiculously pl uh, plays. Like this return of serve here. He just goes for some ridiculous return of serve deceptive shot, which just gets killed instantly. And then they just fully gave up and just started lifting the shuttle up in the air. It didn't look like they even gave eye contact with each other once. And in, in, in the end, it was just so easy for the Japanese pair. He just walked over them. We then saw something which I've never really seen before in the last point. Hoki served to Sukumolio, and Sukumolio just purposely didn't even try and hit the shuttle, and just went over to shake hands with his opponents. You just can't do that at this level, and there's clearly something going on behind the scenes between the two. For me personally, I think it's time for both of them to split up, find a new partner, or stop altogether, as this clearly can't continue. And what do you guys think? They look like a shadow of their former selves, and even when they don't completely lose their heads, a lot of pairs have figured them out now. Gideon doesn't have the power at the back uh, that he used to have, and there are far too many mistakes out of both of them. It's, just, it's a big shame, uh, but it's been going on for way too long now. Let me know in the comments if you agree, or what do you think Kevin and Gideon should do next. Please remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and I'll see you in the next one.